submit to authority of God, authority of the church that you belong to without personal pride. That is humility. Hear this. If you want to enjoy God into the fullness, keep your personal views. If you want to say to God, I know this, when God is talking to you, then that is pride. The Lord said that, have you ever considered my servant Moses, the humblest man on the surface of the earth? But the man is full of anger. Two of us. And God is saying, he's the most humblest man. That is to say, inside Moses, Despite his anger, the man has the fear of God. But to come out of hardship, gross darkness, thick darkness that cover the earth and the people is true humility. And what is humility? The fear of God. If you are alone, you are not in the public, and you can still fear God and not engage into wickedness. Wow, heaven will clap for you. For you to break out of hardship, true which is the fear of God. One of the principles of God to bring someone out of hardship, tough time, management. God will never give to you what you can manage. God hates waste. The resources of God is not given to be wasted. If you want God to make you a millionaire, God will give you a thousand and we wait how you manage the one thousand before he can entrust you with millions. You can't manage what you have. You are asking God for increase. God is not stupid. Your ability must be tested before increase can be given. The reason why you are still going through hardship is because management skill is not in you. Until you prove to God you are, that you are able to manage what he promised you, that is when God will release it.